Hi everyone, I'm Bag of Dawn at StockMarketCaddy.com. It is October 20th, October 20th at 1 p.m. I was asked whether or not um, the swing machine um, provides signals on a daily basis for stocks and ETFs, and it most definitely does. We, of course, use um, the swing machine for our daily, weekly, and monthly signals on stocks, ETFs, options. Uh, underlying thereof uh, futures markets we also use it intraday you, we're going to take a quick look at the Nasdaq 100 um, trading today and I'm going to sort the top performing markets um, today percentage wise and you can see what they are iSurge, Priceline, Luminar, Google, Goog, Baidu, Adobe, PayPal, Amazon, Costco and let's just take a look this is how our members would be positioned long it says how many days ago they went long assuming they had placed 100 shares long on these positions this is how much they would be up or down this is the entry price the entry time the entry date we also provide what we call the combined trend the GPS signal near, the GPS signal distant, and the altimeter. None of this data uses moving averages. They don't work. And you can see our top 10, the index itself, 40,000, 14,000, price line 3, 1,200, 5,000, 4,000, um, 8,000 on Baidu just 10 days ago. Adobe 100 shares, you'd be up 2,300. PayPal almost 3,000. And yes, we do get a couple of little drawdowns. How about on the dark side? Anybody can pick the winners, right? How about Celgene down $13 today? How are our members positioned short when five days ago? They're up 1,443 on just. 100 shares in five days. How about Regeneron down $10? When did our members go short? 30 days ago. 100 shares, almost $1,500. How about BIB? Our traders, our members are long 86 days ago. You can see all the correlating information. Up 100 shares would be 5635 Orally, they're long. It's currently in a dip. They're down just 80. And you can see the, the top 10 for being down. Some are short. Some are just in a dip. But virtually almost all profitable. That is the NASDAQ 100. Let's go to the S&P 500. And let's do the exact same thing. I haven't even done this yet. So I have, well, I'd say no idea. But I've got a pretty good idea based on our history here here they are here are the top S&P 500 and if you hear some heavy breathing in the background that's my dog mulligan <laughs> but here they are big percentage gainers let's look at the top 10 positions assuming 100 shares look at all this green folks okay long and short how about the top losers of the day sell gene you know many of them okay some of them the same top 10 look at this every single position is profitable and PG is actually entering today assuming 100 shares I'm Bag of Dawn at stockmarketcaddy.com and if you like this approach and you don't want to be looking at charts until you're you know blue in the face um, and want an objective consistent view of the markets feel free to check us out at stockmarketcaddy.com